Hello everyone, welcome to today and welcome to this video. We're starting off here at Einstein Bagels. And we've got the goods. I went with the egg and cheese on a spinach Florentine bagel. This is my go-to and it's it's becoming our go-to before baseball games because it's kind of right down the street from the stadium and it's a heck of a lot cheaper than stadium food. Pro tip for you. Right. What sure. did you get? I got honey wheat bagel with uh, honey butter spread. Okay. Spread. That sounds good. Hello everyone. Welcome. Welcome back. We are at Tropicana Field once again to see the Rays play some baseball, if you couldn't tell. They're not just playing any team though, they're playing the Yankees, the New York? New York Yankees, New yeah. New York Yankees, which I've never seen before, so I think that's going to be pretty darn cool. We're also going to be meeting up with some pals and uh, just overall having a really great time here at Tropicana Field as we always do and hopefully seeing DJ Kitty as well. Yes, I did bring DJ Kitty. You got pocket I, size. I didn't, see bring, the real size. I didn't bring a sign this time, uh, next time. We'll do one next time, but I do have DJ Kitty, so excited to see DJ Kitty well, as yeah. always and hang out with pals. So anyway, gates have opened. It's a very, very, very busy crowded day so far. Yeah, Lots right. going on. We got pals waiting on us, so let's get going. Let's go. Let's play some ball or play watch ball. them play the ball. And we're making our descent over to the Tropicana now. So much traffic, encountered so much traffic on the way here, more than I've ever seen before. It's gonna be a packed game, as, as Jay was just saying, there's more Yankees fans around here than there are Rays fans, quite frankly. So, I think we're gonna see a lot of Yankees fans, a lot of people rooting for the other team. Oh no. Just another shot here of everybody piling on in. The gates just opened a few minutes ago, maybe like 10 minutes ago. Lots of people here. We're gonna head through security. Meeting up with fellow race fan Adam the Woo. And Thank this you. is my first time meeting Daphne too. Yeah, I'm so from the Daphne this. show. Yeah. Oh, exciting. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, All right, yeah. base baseball buddies, and uh, we're gonna head in the chop. I was just saying that we are in first and Yankees are in last. So. What place are the Yankees in? Last. Oh, that's right, yeah, that's a good thing. That's a good time. And I think the Red Sox are kind of kind of uh, teetering on the bottom it's too. I never thought we'd see the yeah. Orioles and the Rays be at the top of Let's the Let's enjoy day. it while we can. <laughs> yeah, this could all turn, turn a different way. Look at this crowd. Very soon. All right, yeah. let's head in. Yeah, let's go. Nice to meet you. Let's have some fun. Let's do it. Yeah. Chris, the girl. Yeah, all we're ready. Let's go. And DJ oh, Kitty. And DJ Kitty so over here. Out. And Nuke from Bull Durham. Right here. Ready. Triple, yeah, triple A race. Yeah. Repping the triple A race today. <laughs> and we made it inside of the Tropicana. Boy, oh boy, is it loud. They got a DJ this time, but it's not DJ Kitty. Why are they not using DJ Kitty? I don't understand. Oh, oh he's on a big ball. Oh my gosh, he's going forward. No. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Endless talents here. Endless talents. Endless talents. <laughs> We're gonna get run over. Oh my gosh. All right. We're good. We're good. He's moving on to other territory now. So we actually went over to the right hand side once we entered the Tropicana. We don't usually come over this way, but this is where they have like a bunch of it's almost a museum back here. There's a Tampa Bay Rays Hall of Fame. There's the Rays Cave right in front of us. And a bunch of really interesting things around here that you wouldn't expect. Here we go, Tropicana Field. First look for this game. Also interesting to note that they are, they have opened the very tippity top section of the stadium. Now people can sit up there. That is how dang busy this game is gonna be. We already see some smatterings of people up there at Youth Baseball Day. Look at all the kiddos. Just kind of walking on the field here and then heading right on out. I think maybe they're taking a tour of the field, of so the entire stadium, I don't know. It's a lot of kids. On the bottom floor now, Raymond's turf, not DJ Kitty's turf, but Raymond's turf. I think we're actually gonna try to find DJ Kitty in just a sec here also. Raise Mickey over here. Raise up, Mickey. Okay, I was just gonna say, why are we in line? Like, why is this happening? Why is it so busy down here? It's because this is the line for the kids. This is the youth, the youth line here. We're in the youth line. 
Maybe if we keep going, we can just go on the field. Now, we'll forgo that. You can see they're heading on into the field. There they go. That's a lot of kids. Wow. Went back to the main entrance to see if we could find DJ Kitty, and I don't see him out there, but wow, it is bumping in here, and I don't mean just the music. We're gonna head inside of the store. Check it out. They have custom bats here. You can make custom baseball bats. Never seen that before. That's pretty legit. DJ Kitty baseball bat. I gotta admit, I never thought about getting a raised pin, but maybe I should get a raised DJ Kitty pin. I do have a kind of a pin collection going right now, so I might pick this up today. They also have DJ Kitty cowbells as well, specific DJ Kitty cowbells. That is also tempting. And you've heard of foam fingers, but have you heard of foam rays? You could stick this on your hand and raise up with it. That's kind of hilarious, actually. And I meant to bring my DJ Kitty Paw today, or our DJ Kitty Paw, I should say, because technically it's Tampa Jays, but I forgot it. No! All right, DJ Kitty check. They have plenty of DJ Kitties here, so you still can grab one. By the way, this is the children's section up on the second floor here, but uh, dang it, why don't they make this for adults? That is not even fair. I would wear this every single day. This hat's really cool too. It's almost like a, it's got like a pinstripe on it. DJ Kitty's on the front and it's reversible. Raymond on the inside, but no one wants to see Raymond. So we're gonna keep him on the inside of this hat. But unfortunately it's still for babies. So dang it. Oh my goodness. And look at this derpy little DJ Kitty sign. Property of the Tampa Bay Raids. Look how stinking cute he is. Put this on a shirt, put this on a hat, and I will buy thousands of it. That is so, this is so cute. And did you know that Dr. Strange is a Rays fan, evidently, because he's all over the merchandise. Dr. Strange, Tampa Bay Rays, he's a fan. Good to know. Although, why wouldn't he be a Yankees fan? Isn't he from New York? Oh well. Oh yes, and we gotta say hello to the Rays. Someday we're going to sit right there. I'm, I'm calling it right now. That's my number one spot that I want to sit right next to the Rays. It is busy, busy, busy in here. We are just waiting to get over to where our seats are, and it's quite a line. We stop and go. Oh my gosh, never seen it so busy here before. Rays. And we're T-minus 19 minutes. Until the game starts. And he's all the way down there, but there he is, DJ Kitty. He's on the stage greeting his fans. It's actually about where we're going to be sitting today. Right in front of DJ Kitty again. DJ Kitty! There he is! Oh, look at him! Taking, <laughs> That's what I call taking a, a pose Reynolds right pose. there. Yeah, there Burt we go. Reynolds. We know who the real star is, and it is DJ Kitty. <laughs> right in front of us here. Okay, I think I'm gonna go get a photo with DJ Kitty, because it's not too busy right now over here. I think this is a perfect time. Oh, he's taking a snooze. He's taking a little power nap over there, a little cat nap. He is a cat after all. They sleep like 20 hours a day. He needs a nap. Taking a little snooze. Oh, DJ Kitty. DJ Kitty, he ate a, he had a big, he had a big uh, lunch today, I think. Just taking a snooze. How adorable. I love you, DJ Kitty. Hey, DJ Kitty. What's up, DJ Kitty? Hi. Yeah. Yeah, get a picture? All right. All right, Daphne and Adam getting their pictures, getting their time with DJ Kitty. It's Daphne's first time seeing DJ Kitty, and she's just as excited as I am. Yeah, there they go. Getting their photo with DJ Kitty. Awesome. And we got a couple of things here at the store. I got a DJ Kitty pin after all. It's got DJ Kitty on his little DJ board here and it says greatest scratches, which I thought was adorable and hilarious. And it wasn't that expensive, only $10. So that is a great purchase. And as you can see back here, I got the foam ray. You want to test it out? Yeah, raise oh, up. Go. That is ridiculous. That is the most ridiculous foam finger I've ever seen. Yeah. 
All right, they're about to announce the raise. The game is it's about to start. He is ready. He is crowd surfing almost. Yeah. All right, here we go. Yankees are up to bat first. Anthony Volpe up for the Yankees. Let the game begin. The Rays are up to bat now. On deck. Strike. Yandy Diaz up. Time out. What's going on? What? What's going on? What happened? Did he step out? I don't know. Ooh. Ooh, Here no. Cash. What's going on? What's happening? What's going on? So huh. you can call two timeouts. The new rule, you can only call one. So it's an Okay. Oh, yeah. wow. That's crazy. All right, here we go. Up to bat again. It's the second inning, and my boy Lau is up to bat. Yeah. Expecting good things from you, Lau. And the game is zips up, zoom it up, up, and down the way. We just finished the second inning. It is speeding quite, quite along there. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. All right, and we got some drinks, as you can see here. And evidently, the Yankees scored. They got a home run. Actually, it was a grand slam, so now it's 3-0. Oh, crap. All right, Randy Arena up to bat, third inning. I want to see this in slow-mo. Okay, we've we've had some action here. In the fourth inning? Is that what we're in, the fourth inning? We're in the fourth inning, yeah. Fourth inning, and the Yankees scored twice. Five nothing. If there's anything that I've learned about the Rays, they can do anything. The amazing race they can yeah we were here a couple games ago and they were down like uh six to like one and they came back to walk off home run exactly so, so i have faith it can happen i have faith all right between the fourth and the fifth inning now no one has scored five to zero to the yankees we're gonna get some food next there's a lot of different choices that i could choose from as far as food goes here the tropicana but I think I've decided to go with the popcorn helmet bucket thing. I've gotten it once before. I'm gonna get it again. Popcorn sounds really good. And evidently I've made a huge mistake with my decision, as I often do, because the line, you can see, like, there's no one here in line to, like, actually order food. But this whole huge line here is to pick up food. Oh, the race scored! Yay! Well, that's good. That's good news, at least. So now it's 6-1, because I think the Yankees scored in the last inning anyway, or in the last uh, last time they were up to bat. But yeah, so I'm in this really long line just to get this stupid popcorn helmet bucket thing. Unfortunately, one of the workers at the stand took pity on us and decided to take orders as well. So I got my popcorn helmet and it's piping hot. So yippee, win all around. All right, Simba cam time. Got DJ Kitty, Tampa Jay's got his fries. I don't think we're gonna get on the Jumbotron though. Not this time, probably. Tampa Jay is trying something new. They're french fry, french fry taters. Beer battered. Ooh, those, they are really good, yeah. And they're piping hot too. All right, so now it's 6-3. Yankees still winning, but we're making a comeback. We're making a comeback.
That's your, right. Uh, raise that up. That is amazing. See, we always come back. Or well, Usually we come back. You said it. You I were like, home. Yeah. this team's amazing. Yep. They're the amazing race. Them. They always come back. Mm -hmm. And you were right. Yep. And I got to say that this is probably the game that I've been like the most into. Like I'm on like the edge of my seat, like watching yeah. everything, saying things that I never thought I would say, like go <laughs> team and that's cheering for players and not even just DJ Kitty. That's so. awesome. That's baseball right yeah. there. I'm into it. I'm into it. It's dramatic. It, it truly is. is. Yeah. It's a it soap is. opera. You can feel energy in here as they say yeah and someone proposed to someone earlier they too. sure did yeah Over suckers here. i mean oh and we're in the seventh inning the yankees scored again it's seven seven and there's raymond he's beating up a fan it looks like that does sound like raymond all right i don't care if it is i sound too busy it's Throwing stuff at people. Look at him go. Where is DJ Kitty? All right. Go Raymond. He's doing the monkey. He's doing the monkey. He's excited. Okay, eighth inning. Raise up to bat. Woo. See what happens. It's still tied. Can't remember if I said that or not. DJ Kitty, he's here. He's ready. Spin that wheel. Yeah. Uh -oh. What's going on? Oh. That's close. That's close. Do you do you still love me even though my hand is now a ray? I do. I, I actually love you even more. You do? Yeah. Good, because it's never it's never coming off. This is my hand now. Yep, this is my hand now. All right, this is getting weird. All right, folks, ninth inning. The Rays are up to bat. The Yankees did not score. It is still tied. We have time. Everybody is pumped. Pumped. Whoa! Extra innings. But I will say extra innings are better than no the innings. other team winning. winning. Yep. So it's all right. We still have time. Time. We have time. So much. We got one more inning. Come on. Oh my gosh. That was a great pickle. What just happened? Oh, someone's hurt. Oh my gosh. Who got hurt? Who's down? Who's down? It was what just happened? Someone got hurt. It was a good pickle, but not get great because someone got hurt. Who is down? So there was a person on third, and they were running oh towards gosh. home, and then they were just playing ball with each other as they were trying to get him out, and then one of the players got hurt. One of the Rays players got hurt. What in the world just even happened? And they're bringing out a wheelchair for him now. Oh no! Looks there like we go. An ankle or something. Oh, he's declining the wheelchair. No, he denied it. He's, he's gonna so walk it out. Okay. There we go. All right. Woo! And he's okay. Game on! Woo! Man, intense. Give him a little warm up. Intense game. Three, two. Two out.
obviously, if you couldn't tell, the Rays won. We won the game. And the real Rays are taking their victory lap. Well deserved. That was a very stressful game. But I bet the Rays here never lost out. Never lost hope in their team. Good job, Rays. You did good. Next time we're sitting here, I'm calling it right now. Yeah, ew, that felt disgusting. All right, that's it for the Tropicana. That was a lot of fun. Again, very intense game, wow. Most intense baseball game I've been to so far. And that's gonna do it for today's video. Had a really great time at Tropicana Field as I always do. And it's always an added benefit when the Rays bring home the W. Victory. Always a good thing. It's uh, yeah, that's 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 not a bad thing. And honestly, like, what an awesome game. The drama of it all. You know, it wasn't a a full-on sweep. Wasn't it an easy win? No. It was not an easy win in any way, shape, or form. It was a very up and down game, and that's kind of what you want in games, right? I mean, it's always awesome when your team is sweeps, but it's Thrills also the game, baby. yeah, it's, it was thrilling. I was literally like on the edge of my seat, like oh my gosh, but I've never been so stressed at a game before, and and I can see myself being more and more invested in the sport with every single game that I go to. It's addictive, and it's a lot of fun. Yeah, it's it's a lot <laughs> of fun going to the games with you and with our pal Adam as well. Um, it just makes it so much more fun. And um, of course, we met Daphne today as well. Uh, such a sweetheart. So make sure, of course, you check out their channels as well if you haven't already. The Daphne Show and The Daily Woo. And also, Tampa J had his camera here too. So make sure you check out that video. Thanks, babe. As well, he just hit 70K subs. That is amazing. And no, I don't mean the sandwich. I mean, the amount of followers 70, submarines. on your channel, oh, thanks, which is babe. really, really cool. Much appreciated. Thanks, everyone. It's very amazing. So, thanks, babe. yeah, but that was it. That was the day. Oh, yeah. And shout out to Ryan, Splore oh, Ryan, yeah, and his Ryan. lovely family who we ran into at the end of the game as well. The man who saved our man lives. who saved our lives. Splore and Ryan. Okay. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Really appreciate it as always. And we'll see you all very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Bye-bye, everybody. Chris the girl. Make sure you give her a thumbs up and subscribe below if it's your first time. Appreciate it. You won't regret it. Thank you. She's amazing. She's I beautiful. Appreciate I love her. I appreciate it. Okay. Mwah, 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 mwah. Bye-bye, everybody. Brownie See you soon. <laughs> Bye-bye. Just have to end it here with a beautiful shot of the Tropicana field glowing in the sunshine. All right, thanks all for watching. Really appreciate it as always. See you soon.